Okay, it's looking absolutely beautiful out here. I love this weather. You know, Texas has some really nice weather at times, but then it gets super hot. And if you're in your garage like I am, anyone will be sweating profusely. I love Texas, okay? I love Texas, but there's one thing that I absolutely hate about living in Texas. And if you're a car person, ow, hit my side mirror here. But if you're a car person, you absolutely know what I'm talking about. And that has to do with having a license plate in the front of your vehicle. I absolutely hate it. You know, at first when I had my Highlander, I didn't care as much. When I had my Honda Accord, I didn't care as much. Now that I have my Genesis and it has this huge, nice looking grill. Look, I mean, look at this. It's a beautiful front end of the vehicle. It just looks bad now with this license plate. I. I I don't like it. I know a lot of people that love their vehicles don't like it. And some of them put it uh, relocated to the side of the vehicle, like somewhere right there and stuff. I just wish that Texas adopted one license plate. Like every other state bordering Texas has only requirements for one license plate in the rear. Keep the front end nice. People don't want to drill holes in their front of their vehicle. Come on, Texas. This is a 1942. This is 2018. One license plate should be enough. This ruins the beautiful front end of this vehicle. There's a $200 fine if you don't have a front license plate. I don't want to feel like paying for that. I mean, it is a fix it ticket, but still, I don't want to go to court and stuff like that. I'm just going to leave it on until they change the law hopefully okay but in terms of products I have two products right here one I'm kind of covering up because I don't want to show it to you yet is probably the hands-down best product I have ever reviewed on this channel ever hands down best probably and the other one is something that you guys love from my videos and there's something different about it so let's let's start this video let's check it out let's see what they are all about Hey guys, Gokin here, making more videos again, and today guys, we have two different products. Both of them have a little slight twist that I've never done on my channel before. So without further ado, let's get to it. Security vehicle just passed by. He, I bet he's always wondering, because there's like no one out here in my neighborhood except me, and, and we do have a security patrol like our neighborhood with his vehicle, with a security vehicle. And he always sees me in my house and is like, dude, you're, you're always here, what do you do when everyone else is at work? Shh. All right, real quick, before I get to the meet and greet of this video, you guys already know I love solar power LEDs, and a lot of people on this channel also love Love solar power LEDs. So I wanted to find something for you guys a little bit different. Maybe it will be of use for you guys. Here it is. Let's open this box real quick. This is a LED floodlight. Sure, it looks like a normal solar LED floodlight, okay? It, it does, it looks normal. Let me just take it out here. Oh, comes with the literature, guidance marking, and screws and stuff. Very simple, not unique at all. And on top of that, this thing even looks very, you know, ordinary. It looks like something I've done before, has the solar panels on top, has the lights right here, has the sensor right here for when someone walks in front of this thing, this thing lights up like a white light Christmas tree on steroids. I'm not kidding you, that's how bright these things really are. But in fact, what makes this very unique and different, and I've never done this on the channel before, is Look at that. It has extra solar panels on the side like right here as you can see that you can open up to get more sunlight to charge the batteries even faster in case you're living in parts that might not have, you know, as much sunlight as the great Texas, you know what I mean? Look at all that sun. Look at my face. I'm like sweating and stuff. Okay, sun. We have plenty of you here in Texas. But there's some places that might require a little bit more charge time that you might require and that you might want. Bammo, this might do the trick for you, okay? I've never seen this before. This looks promising. The reviews were great. Now let's do a quick test to see how bright these things actually are. Alrighty guys, so I've closed the garage, I've turned off one of the lights. A lot of people wanted me to test out this, uh, you know, solar light in a closed environment. And what better place to actually test it out than a garage. As you can see, once I turn off this light right here, I'm going to pull this lever and it's going to get super dark in here. Look at that extremely dark can't even see anything in here i can barely see anything because it was super bright obviously my eyes are barely getting adjusted now and we're gonna turn on the solar light to show you how bright these things can really get ready oh my look at that guys look how insanely bright this thing is this thing is like a light bar spotlight pretty much and it is extremely bright as you can see okay, i'm just moving it around the garage look how bright it is 
I mean, seeing is really believing. I hope you guys understand. They can really get extremely bright. And sometimes they are so bright that I actually like to leave it on a low dim mode pretty much because I don't want to disturb any neighbors. I have so many of these things around my house that I don't want to disturb the neighbors sometimes. But a lot of people do love it super bright like this. And I totally understand. But as you can see, it's like a giant flashlight, just, you know, super duper bright. And if I, you know, put this down, you can see how dark it gets in here. But then when I have it back up, as you can see, it's super duper bright. Really, really nice product, guys. Here are the LEDs just to show you how many LEDs are. I mean, they're just ridiculous amount of LEDs. Really dark, really bright. Look at that. That's why I love these things because they're like free electricity for how bright these things really are. So yeah, I was not kidding you when I said that these things really do get bright and the reviews on Amazon will tell you the same thing, that they really are awesome. For something that just, you know, screws onto a wall somewhere and you never have to worry about it. It automatically turns on at night, automatically detects when someone is present and it turns on full brightness, dim mode when no one is there or off, whatever you want. And the best part about this one, has these extra solar panels on it. That really makes it awesome and unique and different from any one that I've seen and I've reviewed. Really, really awesome. So, so I'm gonna put this link in the description below. You guys already know it. I love this thing. I'm gonna be placing this thing on a house and I know you will love it. So now, the product that I am super excited about because it is so different. I've done something similar to this, but nowhere close to how awesome this thing is. And it's from a company called EU and it's their all-seeing rear view mirror camera. When I saw this on Amazon, I really couldn't believe that something like this actually existed because this whole thing is a screen, but yet with a tap of your finger, it becomes a mirror. I know in the past I've done a video on something like this. A lot of you guys thought it was awesome. Me too, I really think it was really awesome. I still have it on my friend's car. He absolutely loves it. But this thing combines everything you need in terms of camera and stylish looks and actual functionality. And I guarantee you it will impress your guests in your vehicle because when you touch this mirror, this whole thing turns into a screen. Like when I saw this, I was like, dude, I gotta get this. This is the coolest thing I've seen. Let me just unbox it. Slowly take this. Oh yes, look at that. This is definitely gonna blow my mind when I unbox it and actually plug it in. All right, let's take off the cover. Let's put it down to the side. Look at this, guys. Oh man, nice. So this thing comes equipped with the actual rear view mirror slash screen, obviously. It's a screen and mirror put together. It comes with a camera already attached on here in terms of a dash cam. And also it comes, if you require it, another camera for the rear of your vehicle in terms of backup camera. This thing is just like a haul-in-one kit for everything you require. All right, let's take out some more packaging stuff. Oh, look at this. Here's the actual mirror right here. I'm gonna put this down to the side real quick. Oh, I can feel the camera right here as well. Here's a bunch of accessories in here. I'm gonna put it down to the side real quick. And then last but not least, the actual backup camera right here. This is if you require a backup camera. A lot of vehicles might not require a backup camera. A lot of vehicles do require a backup camera. So this comes already in there with a backup camera already here. Okay, nothing else in the box itself. Let's take a look at the actual secondary box that they give you. A bunch of accessories in here in terms of pry tool, to hide wires, 3M tape right here. Got a cleaning cloth as well. A lot of extra wiring in here just in case if you require it. For the backup camera, you know, to have it go all the way to the back of the vehicle, all the way to the dash cam itself, the dash mirror, whatever you want to call it. That's exciting. And finally, a plug and play adapter for the mirror dash cam video screen. And you cannot forget the literature. All right, let's take a look at the actual mirror, you know, screen dash cam combo thing. Oh. Oh, oh man, look at this thing. Let me just take off this uh, screen protector here. Oh, look at this, guys. Comes right off and you can see it's just a mirror. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. So just making sure that it is a mirror. Yep, it is a mirror. But when it's all hooked up and plugged in, when you tap on this mirror with your finger, it turns into a full size screen. How cool is that? So it does have a power button right here and the entire mirror is a touch screen. On top, USB, AV in, SD card, GPS in. The profile of this thing is really, really thin. Some people don't like it thick. I 
definitely understand this is ultra thin as you can see it's, it's pretty thin and the back has some padding right here to keep it secure you're gonna be using this black rubber slash silicon tire right here to hold this down onto your original mirror so you know technically you don't have to like unscrew anything and drill anything you just just you know hooks onto your original mirror last but not least it has the dash cam as you can see this is the dash cam on this device so if you're a person that does not want to use the backup camera it is totally understandable because this comes already hooked up with the front facing camera aka dash cam to record everything that's going on in the front and this thing actually does move around and stuff so you adjust it to where you want it to be pretty much now what I want to do is go to my vehicle just hook it up plug it in and just see how this thing actually works so without further ado let's get to it alrighty guys as you can see I've already installed it on this Highlander right here it literally took me like three minutes just to install this bad boy because of how simple it is you just basically put it on here strap it on they include the strap the silicon rubber base strap you know just stretch it on stretch it on and then the last thing is basically plug it in as you can see I've plugged it in the wires running down and I've just you know plugged it in straight in here into my 12 volt power source car charging port you know just plug it in plug and play however I know in the future when I do put this on a vehicle that I'd want to put this on I'm gonna make sure that I nicely route the wire through here as you can see this is my original dash cam right there and I've nicely route the wire through here just pushing the wire like this whenever the you know just push it through here all the way and then get right here and then go all the way down to right there so that is the first part okay now the second part if you do want to you can hook up the actual camera in the back this is the backup camera that you hook up to your reverse light and you bring the wire all the way up here now in my case I do not require this but if you do require this there is an option for you here it is everything is here in this package you don't have to go out and buy anything else to hook it up you don't have to buy an extra camera you don't have to buy extra wires everything is right here to hook it up to make this bad boy work in my case, I do not require this, but if you do, you have two cameras, one right here and one in a dash cam. One looking behind you and one looking in front of you. Let's actually turn this car on. Let's see what it does. Let's put it on. Whoa. Oh my God. What? Oh, that is brilliant. Look at that. It looks, oh my God, that is, that's my, that is like my door right there. That's my door. As you can see, that's my door right there. And that's my light switch and everything that's in front of me right there. Everything is recording. I'm going to put my hand right here and you can see it's recording everything. Really, really awesome already. Oh my gosh. Th that works way better than I thought it would. And so let me, uh, I think you press this button right here to turn it back into mirror mode look at that oh my god look at that it's back into mirror mode now let's bring it back to screen mode you can see my hand is right there and it, it's actual mirror you know what i mean there's nothing to it it's actually a mirror and let me bring it to the, the screen mode by just touching it look at dude that is so awesome guys i am loving this thing that is not the right time nor right date i know a lot of people might be asking no this is not the right date and the right time don't worry about it but words cannot describe how awesome this is this is absolutely flawless i mean seriously look at this it turns off and turns into a regular mirror you can see my hand right here let me turn on you can see my hand right there and then when i touch it it turns back into a screen look at that i am loving this thing guys this thing is awesome so if you're with your friends or something you got your mirror you know what i mean it's a normal mirror and then when you click on it let's look at what my dash cam is doing and, and when you hook up the other camera to your reverse light you put it in reverse this thing automatically turns on into your backup camera and it is awesome. It's an all-in-one system, guys. I love this thing. It's absolutely beautiful so far. I really am excited to show off this thing to my friends. As you can see, I'm just going to do it one more time. This is just awesome. Look, look at that. From mirror to screen. Absolutely beautiful. A lot of people in my other videos didn't like the fact that only part of the mirror had a screen, like right here. But this is the entire mirror. Kind of like the Cadillac that mastered this kind of backup mirror system. Beautiful. I'm loving this thing. Now, I also want to test the touch functionality of this thing. Uh, just make sure that oh okay so just making sure that you know it's working well as you can see i'm clicking on the things and everything is working well you can see how beautiful it looks exposure loop recording video resolution look at that it's it i mean it just works date and time just put the date and time this is this is awesome guys this is really awesome so once you have the sd card in there you have it hooked up it will start recording right when you turn it on it's a set it and forget it kind of device don't have to worry about it and it just works guys absolutely beautiful let me turn it back into mirror mode right here as you can see there's my mirror there's my camera there's me back there when and when i touch the screen 
it turns into a monitor pretty much. It got really good reviews and this is fairly new on the market. So make sure you go pick it up if you like it. The link is gonna be in the description below. I am absolutely loving this. I cannot wait to go through, you know, all the settings and menus and stuff and see everything that it has to offer. Actually start using this on one of my vehicles that doesn't have a dash cam and doesn't have a backup camera. It will be awesome. So I'm loving this thing and I know you will love it. All right, so definitely one of the coolest products I have ever reviewed on this channel for sure. I mean, this thing by itself without power is a mirror, but then with power is a screen. Come on, it's gotta be one of the top coolest things on my channel, guys. I love this thing, it's so cool. It's definitely something that will impress people in your vehicle. The dash cam, guys, obviously, make sure you know it does record at night. You can look at the reviews, you know, the link is in the description below, so make sure you go check out the reviews. Even for the solar power light, make sure you go check out the reviews, okay? Okay, I always tell you guys that, you know what I mean, don't just take my word for it. Look at other people's reviews before you actually do purchase it as well. In this case, both of the products, the actual solar power LEDs that I showed in the beginning of the video and also this mirror screen, backup camera slash DVR, all in one, got some pretty good reviews. This is a fairly new product, okay? A lot of people also have a question about, hey, when I go click on the link, it says sold out. Yeah, sure, I know that. Because sometimes it does get sold out fairly quickly, so if it does get sold Sold out, it doesn't mean it's gonna be sold out forever. It's gonna come back. Do not worry. So, like I said, links are in the description for both the mirror and also the solar power light. I am loving both of those products. You guys already know I love solar power LEDs and I love little trinkets and gadgets like this mirror in my vehicle. Just makes it look awesome. I love to entertain my guests in my vehicle like that. I love these little awesome devices that no one else has and no one has seen before. But there should be a subscribe button and also a video button popping right here. Make sure you click on for more videos in the future that guys keep your share saying thanks for watching and peace